Hi, this is Ant again, and uh, we're just going to look quickly at a little bit more of what we can do with structure. Uh, so, using structure free, which comes with Pro Tools, I've just programmed in these little percussion parts to go underneath our beats. Okay, so let's just uh, have a quick listen to those. Okay. So if I bring up the structure free window, so this is our sort of transpose and pitch area. We've used this already to get everything to play at the original pitch, but obviously we, we've still got control over each patch there. Now, um, if I just go to the first one here, if I go to the edit two page, we've got a few things we can play around with. Uh, we can change the velocity sensitivity of the envelope. Uh, and this is the amp envelope, so we can like sculpt the envelope shaping of the amplitude of the sound, okay? So if I solo this, and so this is just on that first sound, I'm just gonna cycle it around. So you can see I can, alter how long it takes that first sound to come in. And if we go on the second one. Okay, so I'm just doing some playing around with the envelopes there. Then we've got the filter here, and this is similar to the filters you find in vacuum or something like that. So I'm using a low pass filter there to affect the high frequencies. Then if I go to the end part of my sequence, we can just listen to this uh, without a bar. So we've got that backward sound, which is the fourth patch. So I've just added some attack to get rid of that little click at the start and make it sort of fade in a bit more. Try out some filtering. So I've done some little tweaks there, which have sort of changed the quality of the sounds. So that just leaves it sounding a little bit less just straight like it did before, just parts of the loop. We've kind of made it our own there a little bit. Just gonna open up the filter on that one. And each of the patches has a sort of little mixer control here as well. So we've got volume there and pan here. So I can maybe just change the pan on them a little. Using stereo in remixes like this is always good. You don't really want everything just coming straight up the middle. So I definitely advise exploring controls like that.
Okay, so hopefully that's given you a little insight into what we can do very quickly and very easily with Structure Free. Okay, I'll join you again soon for another screencast. Thank you.